character <laughs> counts. Thank you. That's why TNT is celebrating 10 years. It's just slipped out. Oh, really? Really? Of the characters you love. <laughs> I'm in my 10th year of playing Lieutenant Flynn, Andy Flynn. Uh, I can't imagine you coming to the set and I'm in my 20th year and me saying, you know, I think I'm tired. I mean, I just, I, I just can't even imagine it, fathom it. I'm having so much fun playing this character because I get an opportunity, you know, to do some lighthearted stuff with G.W. Bailey, which is, you know, unusual that you have these dark stories and, and then you get a chance to do a story which is you know and again this, even though these stories that sometimes they feature they feature Provenza and Flynn uh, they're not they're not drawn out of thin air I mean Mike Bertram who's now uh, was the former lead detective of the city of Los Angeles and is now an executive producer on her show he said <clears throat> these stories come from his experiences with friends and stuff like that and so he says oh yeah I knew guys that and you think, really? And, and you go, yeah. And, you know, and so that's how the stories come out. So you get an opportunity to do that as an actor. It's wonderful. You get to play these really thoughtful, thought-provoking uh, episodes. And then you get ones that are just, you know, you know, today you're just going to be a little silly. You know, which is what life's about. Some days you're serious and some days you're silly. The Major Crimes Unit is back. Okay, where are you? And they're still the best. What about cause of death? At getting the conviction. You're lying. Did I misspeak? A little. Like I always say, my life as Flynn exists between action and cut. You know, but the real, you know, detectives, cops, their their life, you know, begins the minute they wake up and then go to bed at night. And when they they work these gruesome scenes and and they're real and they and we tried to make them as real as we can, you know, without getting gratuitous in some cases. <clears throat> uh, which sometimes people have a tendency to do. But um, you walk through these things and you think the savagery of, you know, of man against man, especially family savagery, is like really insane. I mean, I mean, any act of murder is an act of insanity, I believe. But sometimes when it's, when it's family on family, it's, I mean, it would be, you know, biblical, no one that Cain and Abel is such a smash in the Bible. <laughs> you know what I mean? Provenza. Lieutenant Flynn. Isn't it great that we're coming back in June? Yes. So major crime fans can get more of us on TNT. And Sharon. You mean Captain Raider? Yeah, Sharon. Raider. Sharon. Just don't, don't keep saying that. You know, a few people come up to me a lot of times when I'm eating in a restaurant, you know, and they go, I hope you don't mind. And I go, no, I don't mind. It's when you stop asking is when it's, you know, I'm going to mind. I remember one time, like one of my people who I really admire a lot, besides Meryl Streep and, and, uh, and Gene Hackman, is Morgan Freeman. And I met him at a Screen Actors Guild party. And I went up to him and I said, Morgan, I said, I hope you don't mind me tell, telling you this. I said, no, Mr. Freeman, I said to him at first. And he goes, you know, Morgan. And I said, okay. And I said, I hope you don't mind me telling you this. I said, but you're the man. You are the man. And he goes, Tony. And I, like the fact that he knew my name was like, I was like, whoa. And he goes, Tony, he goes, you can tell me as much as you want. I don't, I don't ever get tired of hearing of it, hearing it. So I said, well, great. And it's a pleasure to meet you. So. That, and that's the voice of God you're talking to right there. Yeah, he's the man. He's the man. Gene Hackman, sadly, is retired. I, you know, that's a shame. Yeah. You know, and but Meryl Streep's still out there. And oh, yeah. That woman is like, she's like from another world. I, I, they're running out of awards. They really are. You should just name it. I, I joked with somebody. You should call it like the Streep Hackman uh, Freeman Award. <laughs> so this way, if they don't win every year, those three, you, you say, oh, okay, but it's named after them anyway. Yeah. You yeah. know, who the hell is Oscar anyway? Let's name it after them. Yeah, who was Oscar? Yeah, was, I don't know any movies he was in. Killers beware. That created some distance. The all-new season of Major Crimes begins June 9th at 9 on TNT Drama. Boom.